Hey guys, what is happening? You know what? We had 15 episodes on the Bajo Quinto, and I told you number 15 was the last one. Well, guess what? I lied. Pray for me, won't you? Pray for yourselves because you wanted to watch this, and you got what you wanted, didn't you? So, here's the deal. I, um, you know what, let's start off with something. I got this at Guitar 48 in Ventura, California. It was in the window, it was baked and dried out, and I am going to try to find the, help me out here, uh-oh, this could be disastrous if I don't do this right, uh-oh, teeter-tottering, there we go, perfect. Anyway, I'm going to find a clip from episode one and show you what this thing looked like. No, I don't have to do right up there right now. I'm just going to blend it in. Ready? Action. I found this in a sun-baked window of a shop. And it was sitting there drying out. Now, I want to spin this around a little bit. This gap is caused by the side rolling out. You see that? So that has to be pulled back in. Um, the rest of this is, let me move this down just a little bit more and get it braced up here. Back in this area here, we have a, a crack running here. And you can tell this is not fine wood. Look at the rough grain. There's a piece, there's a tree branch whorl right there. If I have to put any wood in here, I can just put just about anything I want here. Right here, there's been a lot, a lot of work on, or um, strumming going on here. This is all sunken. This is trying to pull itself up. These are really thick, heavy tuners. And if you look right here, we have a crack going on from here and it loops around to here. So we're gonna have to fix that. Let's look here. You've got a piece of wood that is different cut into here. So they just patched together whatever they had. Okay, wasn't that terrible? Then I took it back to Rob the other night and did I catch footage of that? Let's look at it if I did. If I didn't, I'm just gonna be sitting here looking stupid. You're not gonna tell me anything. This is so nice. Whoa, look at this beast. <laughs> <laughs> this is the one, this was the destroyed guitar from the window. Oh my goodness. Look at you. Look at that neck. <laughs> I love it. Is that a Mexican motorcycle license plate? That's correct. Okay. You got a nice setup on it. I like how you put the pickup in there on the fingerboard. Still have the fingerboard extension. That's cool. Let's plug it in, man. Let's go plug this in. <laughs> That's an amazing, uh, amazing job. I remember how trash this was. Look at that input. I know, and look what he. So now the, the issue becomes uh, So I can sell this thing here. There'll be someone who wants this. You better figure out how many hours you have in this thing. I love it, man. 
Okay, now the important thing. I took it back up to Malibu and I did the final bit of work on the knot. And I am gonna do just a tad more uh, lacquer filling here. And I think I'm actually gonna, a la Ken Parker, epoxy this on. And it'll be ready to go. But remember Manuel Ayala that did episode two in the playlist? Yeah, I got to him today in Southgate. The way things were going, he was at a gig. We're loading. He was loading in or loading out one or another. We went actually set up in the street, and he gave this thing a spin. So let's watch a little bit of footage about the, what this thing will do. I would have never guessed it myself. Let's go check it out. Hey, hey guys. Yeah, it's me. Um, now we're house crashing. We're not just uh, band crash or, or something like that. We're just house crashing. We just pulled up in Southgate, California, cultural capital of the world. And this gentleman right here, huh? como se llama? Uh, Raul. 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 We just pulled up in front of Raul's house and uh, just set up like a gig, kind of. And I want to reintroduce my friend Manuel Ayala from Paramount California Cultural Capital of the World. And the last time we saw Manuel, this guitar was a complete POS, like even uh, worse than it is now. <laughs> Sounds nice, sounds clean. Thing too. with that Manuel thanks and um, Rob at Guitar 48 thanks um, this was one of my best adventures I learned so much about bracing and all kinds of things and the shocking thing is the acoustics turned out okay even when you don't have the pickup on so hey give me a like and a subscribe if you have it and when I had this at Rob's he went digging around. I have a Requinto from Paracho, Mexico, full of holes, tore up from the floor up. You're going to see this one come up pretty soon. Take care of yourself. Sup? It's your buddy, Manny Tarloche, and I want to spend a, send a special shout out to Palmero's Junk Pod Guitars.